back to more Age of Empires 2. We are in the Saladin campaign going into Chapter 4, the Siege of Jerusalem. This level can be pretty tough. I've got a couple of tricks up my sleeve um, for beating this one, but I still think it's going to take us uh, quite a bit of time. So let's get Jerusalem. started. 20 years have I been with the Saladins. Saladin's target is Jerusalem. The great ancient city is sacred to Christianity, Judaism, and Islam is the virtual capital of the Holy Land. If there can be a victor in this endless conflict, it will be the army who holds Jerusalem. To complicate matters, Saladin is determined not to harm the city itself. If a single holy shrine is damaged, the populace might well view Saladin not as a liberator, but as yet another conqueror. All right. So, uh, do not allow any Jerusalem Monastery or the Dome of the Rock to be destroyed. Uh, destroy the five towers defending Jerusalem so that the Saladin's army can occupy the city. So all we really gotta do is destroy some towers within the city. Which is really not a big deal. Shots from our bows rarely miss their mark. So we're gonna go ahead and throw this down here. Smack in the center, so we've got some room for uh, trebuchets. We've got some different archers here, the archers of the eyes. Oh, and I do want to grab my scout, my light cavalry, and we're going to send him around the base. All right, so he's just going to run in a circle for me and scout out, and we're going to grab as many sheep as we can here. Because there's a few in the area. They're not taking my sheep. What the hell? I do not want you to attack. I want you on no attack stance. Oh, wait. There's more sheep. I want all of the sheep. And we're also going to want a house. We'll just throw the house down here in the back. Just uh, group them up there on one sheep. I'm going to want to get walls and stuff going as well pretty quick here. We can snag a whole bunch of sheep. Keep scouting. Jerusalem is pretty close by. It's just like right there. But I want to know everything that's up in here. Ah, see? A lot more sheep. Keep chopping wood. We're going to throw down a lumber camp. Probably right over here. Shh. No. Don't chase him. Just go into a uh, defensive mode. Alright, so we got a nice little stash of gold up here. We'll be able to use that later. Ah, a lot more sheep. There's sheep all over this damn map. Just gotta kind of look for them. And I really just want to uncover the entire side of the map up in here. Chop. And we're also going to wall off our base here in a moment. Let's, uh, well, we're going to keep you guys on that, but I want to get more villagers going. Because we need lots of villagers. We need like probably 20 or 30 of them going here real quick. So the attacks will be heavy and relentless. As usual with this game. Age of Empires is not a terribly easy game. Feel the rest of the map for me, buddy. Feel that guy. He's already scouting me out. They know we're here. We can get a whole lot of food from just uh, just the sheep at the moment. 
we'll scout up this way for me. I want to know everything that's here. Without getting too close to the enemy. Another sheep. And I believe there's one group that'll actually start coming after these deer after a while, which can be pretty entertaining. Because uh, we can set up a castle near there and just constantly kill their villagers as they come through. Right, we're gonna want a uh, stable. I'm gonna grab one of these villagers and get them to start making me a wall. We're gonna want to build this wall, probably right along here. Reveal this area for me, so I can see what I'm doing. Yeah, there's no reason to waste too much surface area. So let's uh, use these barricades to our advantage. Throw down a gate right here as well. We are going to seal off the entire uh, place. We're not just going to funnel them through this time. Oh, yeah, we lost a guy. There should be a relic around here somewhere as well. Oh, jeez, here they come. They're already upon us. Alright, cool. Pretty easy first assault. Come on, villager. A few more of these guys, and we need to get this wall going faster. Once we establish our base, things will be a little bit better. Uh, and villagers. No, 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 no. Oh, you don't. I need some gates. Kill him. So he'll leave me alone. Back up. Right, I'm gonna get another section of the gate there. I like to have lots of gates so I have plenty of ways to get out. No! Stop killing my villagers. Stamp. No. Launch a counter attack. No, you don't. We, oh crap! We're we're already luring uh, Jerusalem out here, which is not good. Ah crap! They have a monk. Kill the monk. Hacking up. All right, let's uh, let's do a little maneuvering here. Hopefully they'll actually come after us and not after the stupid gate. Still a little maneuvering. I really uh, didn't want to trigger them just yet. Looks like I have. Come on over here. The city is ours. Your efforts are futile. No, it's not. It's never futile. Oh, don't take my sheep. Get back here with those sheep. Oh, we're gonna need to start, uh... Well, let's, let's not do that just yet. Alright, we're, we're gonna need to get these people back to work. Work out quite as well as I hoped. All right, good, good, good. Get this wall up. Come on, guys. Build me a marketplace as well. Uh, we need to wall this off up here. And wall that off, and then we'll have that stone camp and this uh, gold camp within our base. Which will be perfect. Actually, uh, no, 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 no. Yeah, just like that. No, hold on. Build a gate right there. Get another little section of a wall right there. Okay, whatever. Our guys are really hurting right now. 
Can I garrison summon? I can garrison summon there. I'm wrong. We're gonna need a market. Let's get that market going. But no. Can I get rid of these? They're just taking up space. Let's move that market back some. So we've got kind of a small encampment here. We're going to want a stable as well, so let's go ahead and get that up. Oh, wait. No, we already have a stable. Never mind. Alright, so our population is full. We need wood. We've got wood. We need houses. Get to work on those houses. I like to bunch my houses up in the back when I'm playing um, against the AI. Because they don't know to just go straight for your houses. Unlike a real player, many of them would do that. Because it's a pretty good, pretty effective strategy. So if you can reduce their population size, they can't really do anything to you. What I may do later is build a little uh, section to kind of lure the guys through. I don't know if I'm gonna do that right now. Let's buy. Let's, let's get these guys going on some more food. Build me a mill so I can get some upgrades. Put on that. Get on the stone. We're gonna need some stone. We're just gonna get like four villagers on stone there. We got six villagers here to build farms with. So, BF, three, four, and five, and six. I still have a sheep here. So let him chill for now. Oh, no, 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 don't let them inside. Kill the monk. Yes. Backing up. Rush a little task force out there and deal with them. Come on, get him. Out there and take that down. Take it out, take it out. Yes, get back inside. Whoa, how'd you get in? What the hell? I don't understand. What am I missing here? <laughs> Apparently there's a section of the wall that is unprotected. And I don't know where that is. Maybe we'll find out in a second when that guy comes through. Maybe it's up here? Can't really tell. It doesn't look like it. Maybe uh, someone just let him through accidentally. I don't know. I don't know what that was all about. I have seen guys glitch through walls before. Occasionally that can happen, but I don't think that's what's going on here. No, no, no. It's not how this works. Do not harass my gold miners. So we've almost got enough for a castle. We need to get that up immediately. <laughs> Buy a little bit. Come on. We need this castle now. We're going to throw it down right there. Because uh, Jerusalem is going to be the main people coming at us. And they're going to be pretty annoying. Because um, of their, uh, their horsemen characters. I don't know what they're called. Byzantine knights, I think. Probably should have made this wall a little farther out, because um, pretty soon we're gonna have a little gap here. But for now, this will work. I'll expand the wall later. Just keep spawning villagers. Let's uh, get some upgrades. Let's 
stockpile our farms. It would be a useful upgrade if I could get it. Alright, get back to mining that stone. Let's see, I may need to uh, send out another scout, but first let's get some Mamelukes going. Build uh, some light cavalry. Alright, throw, down, throw down a mining camp. You can always delete it later. Let's make this go a little faster. I usually space it one block away so it doesn't uh, conflict with any space. A little bit more food. I like to snag these resource upgrades early and quickly. We got so much wood, let's uh, sell some of it and buy other things. Wanted to get the handcart upgrade. University will probably come in handy too, so we can increase our range of our castles. So we'll get one of those up in just a second. Let's grab one of these guys and we'll build a university in this gap here. Yeah, these guys, the, the cataphracts, these are the ones I was talking about. They're pretty annoying. Pretty strong. We're gonna lock this gate so that they can't get through. Bring it! Wouldn't your kind prefer to wander in the desert rather than waste our time? The arch of the eyes are pretty strong. I'll go ahead and garrison my soldiers in here because they've taken some heavy damage. We got some more of these siege weapons. You know, the castle's pretty much taken care of. I never understood why the AI likes to make tons and tons of mangonels and siege weapons and send them all at once. It's just not smart. It's a big waste of resources. That monk. Get back in the gate. That guy, get inside, get inside, don't let them in. Why is the gate open? Okay, good. Put them in there so they can heal up. Right, build me a monastery. Mainly so I can get that upgrade to um, heal our guys, but I am gonna. I really actually think I'm gonna use some monks in this level. I know I've said that in a bunch of others. find a better place to put that. We'll, we'll stick it like right here. I'm trying to keep it a little bit of a distance from the wall because I want to be able to build castles here. Oh my god, how do they get in? Oh, did we lose all of our archers? We did. Shit. Over here. Yeah, we, we need that murder hole upgrade right now. There we go, there we go. Just kind of running them around so that they'll get distracted. Back to work. Okay, murder holes. And okay, we don't have to worry about that anymore. Go ahead and stockpile farms. Because we're getting so much wood anyway, I'm not worried about it. I always have way too much wood. That's what she said. Alright, so garrison units will heal faster. Town patrol, so we can actually see more. We're just a peaceful town. Why do you attack us? Not doing anything to you. All right, we're gonna need some more wood. Grab some wood and go ahead and build the ballistics, so we can be a little more accurate with our castles. Ooh, here come the mangonels once again. Mangonel siege is just relentless. Actually, I don't, I don't even need to worry about sending my guys in there to attack them. Because they're weak. They don't have much armor. What are you doing? Okay, I guess uh, for the glory of the Saracens. <laughs> Goodbye, Cam. My, 
Castle's in a pretty good position to just keep hitting people. We're gonna want to build another. Kind of stick it like right over here, since these guys are gonna attack us. Let's get this castle up quick, and we don't even have to worry about defense. We're also gonna get this. Uh, not bad enemy buildings, because um, we can use that to our advantage. We can build a nice little army of monks, and we can actually convert some of these towers. And I believe there's actually a trick to beating this level right at the beginning by doing that. But I don't exactly know what it is. There it goes. Aha! Now you guys are screwed. Get on repairing that. Send all my guys to repair. Just a few. Yeah, keep wasting your money and impressive precious resources. There's the relic. Alright. Let's get our monk going so we can go grab that relic. Units faster. What else? Oh, I think we've almost got enough for the Imperial Age. We need to find another stash of gold soon. Oh boy. Siege weapons. Nah. I'll take it out. Why is the villager grouped up? <laughs> They're just kind of running around. They don't even know what to attack. You guys shoot them. I'm just gonna run out, run out here and take them out. Tonic knights. Ha! The siege weapon is inside. Down it goes. Get back in there and take it out. Assholes. Stamp. Alright, it's time to start building up some uh, forces. I'm gonna garrison them in their own buildings. We're gonna want a nice little force of Mamelukes because they're extremely valuable for this level. Probably should have been building units much sooner than this. Fire at the siege weapon. Shoot things that actually matter. Where did my monk go? There he is. We're gonna go uh, send in a little strike team in a moment to pick up that relic. I want our monks to move faster. It'd be just all around more awesome. Let's sell a little bit of our wood because we're just not getting gold fast enough. Get our Mamelukes going. Dump yourself off in there so you can heal. Let's increase our walls to fortified walls. And we'll really be rolling in the, def in the uh, defenses. Oh shit! Well, time to uh, build that wall out. I knew that was gonna happen. I should watch a little more carefully. Get back to it. Um, 